Hi, Pastor Jason here. Just wanting to wish you a blessed Sukkot. This holiday uh, celebrates the time that Israel spent wandering in the wilderness, um, living in tents and tabernacles or booths, all of which have uh, become the name of this holiday as well. Uh, but the main point of this holiday, what they celebrate is that God chose to be amongst his people. E even during all of that time and through all of that rebellion, he was there amongst them living amongst them as the, as the glory over the tabernacle, the pillar of, pillar of fire and the pillar of smoke. God chooses to be with his people. The Jews celebrate this holiday in lots of different ways. It's a seven day feast. There's all kinds of joyous celebration. Uh, they eat and sleep outside in, uh, in temporary structures. Um, me, I'm a Gentile, I don't have to do that, but it just so happens that we were camping this weekend and so sort of appropriate as well. Um, but the main point of this holiday, again, is that God is with his people, Emmanuel, God with us. It's no accident that this is the time when Jesus was actually born. Uh, it's not a problem to celebrate Christmas on December 25th, but if you want to be accurate about when his birthday was, it was this week. This is Jesus' birthday. The Jews are celebrating God with us, and he came to be God with us. There's so much about this holiday that points to Jesus, I don't have time to do it in a sub two minute video, but I'll put a link below to a blog that I posted a while back uh, about this holiday. I hope that you are aware of God's presence in your life. I hope that you walk with him and that he is your Emmanuel. If you don't know the peace of God that comes from living life and all of its crazy trials with God as a part of it, then I pray that you would accept him as your savior that you would invite him into your life and that you'd experience the joy of Emmanuel. Happy Sukkot.